I am here because I love ALEC. I love to learn from all of my colleagues around the country, and I love to listen to speakers. We just get so much energy, so many good ideas uh, to go home and make our states even a better place. Most people understand what limited government is. Most people don't want heavy-handed government in their lives. Most people understand the, the spending portion of it, and people don't understand the federalism as much. So we've really worked hard to reach out, helping people understand that rebalancing our government, returning the power to the people as close to the people as we can is, is what we need to do, and they agree. One of the things that I think is so important to uh, to recognize is as I'm talking to legislators here, one thing I know is New Jersey, Florida, California are not like Iowa. So having heavy-handed laws coming from Washington telling us what to do, how to do education, how to do health care, makes no sense at all. So it's really exciting to go home and talk to people about returning the decisions to them or as close to them as we can get it. Our founders were very smart, but also very common sense individuals. And so they, they, they thought through this whole process and realized that they wanted to be able to work together, but they certainly didn't want one government making the decisions for all of them. Everybody was making good decisions at home. They wanted to preserve that, and that's why the Constitution was written the way it is. And I think Governor Walker had a really nice message this morning with the dollar bill. So where where do you want to spend this dollar? Do you want Washington to spend it? Or do you want to spend it closer to home? Well, that just makes sense. So I think when we talk to people and help them understand what federalism is, they absolutely agree with us. You know, I have the luxury in Iowa of actually getting to sit down with every presidential candidate when they come through the state. And so I, uh, that is my question. Tell me what you're going to do to advance federalism. What are going to be the first things you do? And, uh, and, and talk to me about that. That's the one thing I want to know. Because if they're willing to send that decision making back to the states, I think that says a lot about the way they're going to run their administration. So that's the question. I ask every single one of them.